Right, can you say hello? Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to our day. Hello, so for days, Sophie and I have been working on different little projects that we said that we were just both on our like um tab what's my iPad so tablet and we were trying to get something to print on the Cricut but it just wouldn't work it was saying not compatible with this device couldn't do it on Android couldn't do it on Apple had to be on a computer and it was really starting to get to us because like we've just spent all this money on a bloody machine that we can't work with our devices now like for certain projects and we were getting really cheesed off um well whilst Sophie's downstairs <laughs> Do I need to answer? Okay, so thank you. Apologies. So stands those doing my meds, like I just said, and uh, the girls were being really cute, and she told me I had to watch it, so I did, and it was really cute. She wins. Um, but yeah, we were getting really, really pissed off and upset that we couldn't use it, so I decided <laughs> to have a bit of a play around. And again, it was still doing all the same things, no matter what I was doing, no matter what device I was using it on. And then I thought, well, instead of waiting for the device to tell me to put the pen in at a certain point, what was if I put the pen in whilst it's like sat there now and then it'll be ready? Well, I tried it. And one of the designs I made two, three days ago a positive positivity picture um i've got it to work boom i've got it printed out created all by me um i've been working on a few others but i i after i come back from the toilet i was like i'm gonna get the machine up because i don't want to be sat here wasting my time making these pictures to print out if i can't actually get them to print out um so yeah i just thought i'd give it a go and i've succeeded so i am so happy um now i need to go and see if i can sort the stuff that so has been trying to print for a little while and also not been able to successfully do so wish me luck well it's literally been about five minutes and I just thought I'd give it a go and see if I can figure out what Soph was trying to do because I didn't have a go the other day, I just let Soph do it and then she got frustrated and just didn't want to like even think about it anymore and um, I just put it in the machine and pressed go and I got this and well I sent her a picture and was just like is I've only man like, I can only do this. I don't know if this is right, and I can't really say what her response was because it was quite explicit. But um, let's just say this is what she wanted, and she doesn't know how I've managed it. Might have to show her when she comes up from doing tea. Oops. <laughs> Was I 
Where's the gun? Where's the other gun? There she is! Her arms are holding that right now. I just thought you would like to see. And I'm about to feed them now. Well, and then he just brought up all of my tea. And it stung my eyes as well. And Dixie went out for a wee and she came back up. And normally when they go out, we're like, we can smell the outdoors on them. God, it's lingering. Pickle was coming up. Initially, it smelled like the outdoors, and now it's just someone's got a fire somewhere, and it's that's not stank. a good fire. It's not like just a normal like fire. No, it doesn't smell um, right at all. Uh, yeah, it just hit my lungs straight away. That was not pleasant. Mm. Literally, nearly vomited. And it is literally that strong. Not only did it hit Charlie's lungs, but it's also stinging my eyeballs. Yeah. Like we stood next to like a bonfire. That's what it smells like in my opinion. It smells like a bonfire. Yeah. It's not good. No. Um. So we've brought up the resin I did the other day, and it is finally set. So I'm gonna just take the other one out, and then I'm gonna show you. So I'll be right back. So here they are. This one's actually like a two-parter. There's like. It makes it hard, but I was just practicing. Um, we've learned like a few lessons with it, but um, yeah, it's not too bad for the first go. Um, and then that's what the other side looks like, which is pretty cool. Look at that, it's moving on its own. Look the colouring of it. Yeah, I've made a really pretty colour. I'm not going to deny that. And there, there is like these little kind of blue forget-me-not sort of flowers. You can see it. There you go. You can see some of the flowers there. Um, but yeah, this was like a practice run. <laughs> and I'm going to hopefully do some others tomorrow that are going to be the real thing for the person I'm sending them to. But yeah, they're really sparkly. They're really pretty and I like them. With these, like, they, they are sharp on, like, the edges. So this would need filing down. But, um, yeah, in general, I'm pretty stoked with them. Did you just use the word stoked? Yeah, why? That me of so. <laughs> and yeah, you can see like the flowers again on that one. And then there's this again. But they're so smooth. And that's the keyring holes. So yeah, not bad for the first attempt. Join us tomorrow to see more being done. So I am just kind of like hugging over, playing my game, watching YouTube videos, and I'm bloody freezing, so I've just sent Sophie downstairs to get a drink, and she's just like, oh, babe, look at the rabbit hutch, there's snow on the roof, and it's like a proper flurry outside, and it's sticking, and earlier on today, so, um, Sophie's mum was just like, um, good luck getting snowed in or something like that, and Sophie was like, we ain't gonna get snowed in. And there's been nothing. And, yeah, she's just seen this. And then she was just like, oh, my God, it looks amazing. I was like, I can't see anything. Um, and then she was just like, turn off the bedroom light and look at, like, look at the window then, hoping that maybe if it was dark, I might be able to see it. No. So I shouted back up to her that it didn't work. Um, and she said she's going to record it for me. And then I decided to look at the ring camera, like, doorbell thing. And I got to see the snow. 
okay, it wasn't this like seeing it in person, but it still looked really cool. And we're hoping we did turn on and say that if it was still like quite a bit of it and still set, yes, uh, tomorrow, um, we will try and get the girls to go back out there because the last time they had like we had snow, they loved it. But we would have to do it later in the evening a little bit when like there's no kids out because obviously we've got one of the bits of green that we've got is like a bit of a slope so they do like to go um sledding down there so i don't know if we would be able to record it or not because of it being quite dark but we will give it a go um but this is what i can see on the ring camera so you can see what i saw and i think sophie's recording um what she can see We have snow and it appears to be setting. So if it continues coming down at the rate that it is, because we don't know how long it's been, been snowing, but if it does continue to come down at that rate, or might, then we might be taking the girls across there tomorrow at some point in the sky, which would be so cool. But look. The road is disappearing. You can barely see where the path meets the road. I mean, it's not like, I mean, it's flat, but like there's a brick line that you can still see it, but it's nearly gone. Look, look at the snow. Okay. guys it's actually proper snow like look at that flurry that's a big flurry no i don't even know why it's so exciting i can't really see them you can still see the green of it took me to make two hot chocolates with the Kenko machine it's gotten so much whiter outside like you can barely see it now and it's the, the you can't see it at that angle it's just the pieces are just so big you can see it all like floating across the floor it is crazy Obviously, anybody in one of those countries that actually has lots of snow all the time, you'll be looking at this and chuckling to yourselves and being like, what are they what, like, what this excited about? But in the UK, this doesn't happen that often. If we get snow, it's usually just like a little bit that slushes and melts and turns into very deadly ice. Um, but we like snow. Snow is cool, literally freezing that's why it's been so cold today but uh even more snow stay back Careful she doesn't step on your pan. Sit nicely. Hang on. Okay, that's it better. I've got to stop that lunching. Oh.
I bring it to you, Mommy. Bring it here, then. I'll buy a show, Mommy. Bring it here. Yay! Sit. for years and they've never played with it until now so it just goes to show that with their dog's toys they don't always play with them and we only get rid of them when they're fully destroyed and that's why they have so many toys well we've tried a, we tried to sort of clear out their toys you took them out yeah and to put out the front to give for free to people around the estate and she started playing with it didn't yep. she she was just like, I want this one and I want this one. She got like two or three or something, took them away from the pile and was just yeah. like, these ain't going, Mama. No. What am I doing? I'm staring at you. Yeah. It's wow. What's this? Oh, that's mine. It's my book. What's this? Oh, uh, nothing comes out of it. No. <laughs> Wrong Prince. type. Yeah. Right, we need to go for a wee and it's bedtime. So thanks for coming to save us and we'll see you tomorrow. Good night, everyone. Good night. Oh, oh well done. You, you did it, 